Go. Fabled Fabledson, a sweet who lived on the Great Plains, thought he would die of loneliness after living alone for so many years. As you may know, Fabled lived during the time of the California Gold Rush. As pioneers crossed through his land in search of gold, he tried to make them stay by shouting, Live here! Stay here! He got the same response every time from the travelers. No thank you, we're going to look for gold. Instead of giving up, Feeble sat down and got a brilliant idea. Right away, he ordered a thousand goldfish from Peru. As soon as the fish came, he promptly dumped them all into the Now I've got them, thought Feeble. Soon when the pioneers passed by, the, a lady shouted, Look! Look! Gold! As, the, so, as she saw something glittering in the lake. The pioneers raced to the lake and grabbed for the gold in the lake. Soon the heat was really getting to them. They jumped into the water to stay cool. Folks, this is a horrible place to live. We haven't found any gold all day. Let's move to California. There we can find gold, said the wagon master. Yeah, let's get out of here, the pioneers said, and they headed toward their wagons. Feeble's dream started to vanish, seeing the pioneers leaving. Wait, he called out. He suddenly had an idea and started to big, a big bonfire beside the lake. The fire was so huge, the lake started to evaporate into the air. It formed huge clouds, but every time the rain fell, the extremely hot air would evaporate, it, and the rain would go back into the air. Feeble cupped his jaw in his giant hand and thought for a plan. He always thought that he, after loud things happen, it almost always rained after, like fireworks. Didn't it almost rain after fireworks, people thought? This gave him an idea. He took a frog and hypnotized it to make the noise so, he, the, so the rain could fall. Soon the frogs croaked and all the others started to follow. The little minions were so boisterous that soon enough, the air, there was a huge downpour. The pioneers jumped for joy and they decided to stay on the plains. This place is full of miracles. The pioneers loved this place and decided to stay right there forever. The next day, Feeble came in shanty and said, Evening, neighbors.